I just want to say to all the uh, the dozens and dozens of government policy specialists that I'm keeping employed, I would be embarrassed to work for a filthy politician. I couldn't do it. You know, my friend Aaron McBride Lounsbury um, from high school, um, oh, I'm sorry, from college, Aaron was my sports editor. Aaron, I don't mean to do this, but I need to because it's relevant. You know, there was a wrestling coach of all things at Augustana College, and he got caught dealing cocaine. Well, Aaron McBride Lounsbury Platt didn't want to do the story, and we got into a big fight in the Observer office, and I told her I was going to let her go, and she did it. She did the story. She basically rewrote what the Quad City Times had. She didn't think uh, a wrestling coach being hired for cocaine had relevance to the college sports page. And that's where Aaron and I are different. Aaron used to call me crying when I first moved back here saying Sherry was abusing her. Sherry was in a manic spin. She'd be crying. I'd talk Aaron down all the time. And Aaron, you know that's the truth. The Rock Island Argus knows that's the truth. Of course, that's now owned by Filthy Lee Enterprises. Lee Enterprises is going to get it. <laughs> Everybody's going to get it. Have a good one. What did I come on for? Oh, I don't know. I must have said whatever it was. I'm going to hit that bong again. I'm very grateful to the cannabis program. I'm grateful to the federal government. I'm grateful because it's hilarious how this is being conducted. It's not hilarious, though. It's rich. It's being conducted in the way that it should be done. Um, it sends a message. It's respectful of me, even though I'm still over-the-top angry. I mean, I'm being treated with hella respect, actually. I am. <laughs> it's hilarious that the whole town still thinks I'm making the whole thing up. Believe me, guys, do you, don't you know? I mean, you all know. All of you that are harassing me and sending me hateful messages, you're doing it because I'm not dead yet and you can't figure out why. It's just like that Hillary Mimi where Hillary's talking to, uh, oh, Huma, do you want to hear one more funny and then I'll let you all go? Uh, Rock Island cop showed up at my door, God, a year and a half ago. I was all triggered. And he was one of the polite ones before Tomes was elected mayor and the whole entire town went to shit. Anyway, he says, uh, I says to him, I think they're going to find emails from Sherry Bustos on Huma Abedin's laptop. And my God, I think he might have pooped his pants. But we laughed really hard. Have a good day.